wanting these different kinds of love. Very interesting. Do you, do you have any pieces from Ghana or Africa for that matter? Um, we did uh, for the last one mm. with Koko. We we, um, we had a Ghanaian uh, song. Okay. Yes, and uh, everybody was uh, the audience was singing along <laughs> with us. You know. Right. Yes, it was very very beautiful. Right. Uh, this time um, we are having some spirituals, okay. and especially because there is a gentleman coming from US mm. who are flying in especially to join us for this particular concert. Okay. Yes, a young and handsome looking. I'm very very looking forward to meeting him. <laughs> 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 Only 25, I hear. I see. Um, excellent uh, baritone. Mm. So together with him, we are going to do some uh, wonderful duets, uh, love duets, and uh, some spirituals. He'll be singing um, uh, songs by himself uh, with my accompaniment. Okay. Um, songs of um, a French uh, composer, Poulenc, um, uh, Handel, mm. you know. Mm. So it'll be a mixture of many interesting pieces. A mixture of many interesting pieces. Uh, Melissa, yeah. let me ask you, you were at last year's function, or was it the function in 2010? You're already in 2012, it's a new year. That's correct. Um, and um, how did it go for you? Oh boy. In honesty, I'm not a big fan of, of classical music. Oh, I see. This, yeah. it was one of the most moving experiences I had ever had. So, you, so you're a convert now? Oh, I'm a, con I'm a convert. <laughs> Thank and you. I, I'm not sure if I'm just a big giant Na Naomi Suzuki Mochizuki fan, but right. really when, when you ask what she will bring mm. to the event, she leaves a part of herself on that stage because she is, she is spiritually engaged in what she's doing and you can't help but be moved. By, by the performance well. that she gives. And, I, and I'm not saying this because she's my friend. I'm saying this because she's, she really is a, an, an incredible artist. So what are you saying to those who are saying, mm, should I or should I not go? I, I think that they would be doing themselves a grave disservice if they miss this opportunity because this is her last concert in Ghana before leaving. That's right. So this, this will be a very special opportunity. Your last concert in Ghana before you leave. What would, wouldn't you miss Ghana when you're gone? Oh, terribly. <laughs> <laughs> what about Ghana will you miss the most? Ghanaians. Oh, wow. I think uh, Ghanaian people are your treasure. <coughs> I've never met people f so friendly and so open-hearted. And uh, I, I feel absolutely safe, uh, so pleasant to take a walk in the evening. I have a dog, so I take uh, every evening after mm. dinner, we right. take a walk with, with our dog. Yeah. And there are people in the street street saying good evening how are you you know and uh, some people are selling you know baked mm. bananas and so on uh, fruits and so on right vendors uh, yes. in the street right hello hello madam how are you <laughs> and they know me because you know we are always taking a walk a on walk. the same route and right. this kind of experience mm. I, I i will really miss and um, oh by the way i must tell you something mm. because um right after the Jap japanese uh, natural disaster yes in um, uh, last March, we did a campaign to fundraise for Japan. Okay. I had never imagined that I would need to do something like that mm. for my own country. Okay. I was ready to help Ghana, oh, yeah. but uh, I, 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 I hadn't, you know, imagined that I would, I would need to do something for my own country, country. and it was really overwhelming mm. the response mm. of the Ghanaians. Mm. It was really touching, mm. you know. 